Thames Water is the largest water company in the UK. We supply water and disposal wastewater to approximately 15 million customers. We had a pilot with 50 users, which is a big pilot. I'd never even heard of GTAC, to be honest with you, before we engaged them. And then it was down to the users, basically. So we gave them the devices, you trial them, you tell us your feedback on them, and we carried out surveys and scored them. And then it just blew us away on, on the scoring and, and the results on the GTAC. It was hands down winner, it was without a shadow of a doubt. There was a genuine project approach. We were all one team, there was no them, us. We sat in their meetings, they came to our meetings. There was many instances where we were talking about ways to utilise their GPS, improvements in battery life. All of those came as a consultative approach as part of the development on the programme. The users would take the devices out on the field, test them, things like the GPS signal, how fast the units were, how practical they were to use, how durable they were to use on the field. Once that was identified, then a questionnaire was then handed out to all the users, every sort of aspect of each unit and what it was fit for purpose for. It was in the region of 85 to 90% chose to, the, the GTAC unit was the best by far. We bought 480 devices, 400 were for my program, 350 to be deployed and 50 hot swaps. Operations are really important to us. One of the advantages of our Telford Configuration Centre is we were able to hold the main units there and we called off the units so that was to image them, to asset tag them, to get the software up on them, to get the manual with them, to tether them. All of that was done within one day so we were shipping next day. So wherever the demand out of Thames was we could deliver to that training site. So if their training facility changed, say location or the number of users, we could react immediately. The positive things we've found with the device is the screen is a lot larger, the GPS is more responsive, we have a backlight on the keyboard, uh, the touch screen is more responsive, we also have a longer battery life. It's just a generally a, a lot lighter device as well. We have staff come out from the team direct. Um, what they want is to find out if we are having any issues. They take them on board and uh, come back with possible solutions. The Thames project team, they were very, very helpful because they fed back all the information. So all the times they had sessions with the engineers, they let us know what the plus points and the negatives. We were able to address all those negative points so we could come up with an answer that was perfect. And then they realised they were buying into the whole process. So they were fully engaged, which means the rollout was going to be much smoother. In my experiences of working with GTAC, um, I think what surprised me more than anything is the after sales, or shall we say the project's finished and the contact we still get, which is, I think, is really important. The GTAC V110 really is the best rugged mobile PC available in the market today. It's just the kind of device that any engineer would be proud to use.